subscribing and sharing your love. Your love is what is motivating us to go further with every likes. Kindly keep liking. Today, in regards to the shots that have explained what are the types of angles, we will solve this worksheet. So first and foremost, the question says, look at the angles below. Fill in the blanks using acute. We know acute is just a small revision. Acute is anything which is between my 0 to 90 degree, right? Right angle is exact 90 degree. Obtuse angle is which is going to be between 90 degree to 180 degree. As I say, key is important. And reflex is something which is going to be between 180 to 360 degree. Now that I have my key, it's going to be easy for me to know my angles, right? Let's go to the first figure. We see how it is closing. And we know that since there is no box, it is closing. But of course, this is going to resemble my acute angle, all right? Let's go to the second one. As the explanation in the video, in my previous video, I will link it down, said if the arc is outside of the acute or anything that is going to form between 180 to 360 is my reflex angle. So this is my reflex. Next, I see if I draw an imaginary line here, right? If I draw an imaginary line, I am crossing the 90 degree, right? So the definition of obtuse angle is what fits best. Anything that is between 90 to 180 degree is my obtuse angle, right? Next is my, we see a box, isn't it? The definition or the explanation clearly stated. Moment you have this box here, it is your right angle, triangle or right angle. That is how I will know that this is my right angle. Now, my next question is saying, draw an obtuse angle. We know obtuse angle definition is something which has to be between 90 degree to 180 degree. Therefore, what I will do is, first I will draw my baseline. After my baseline, once I have placed the protractor here or just with the help of line, I will take it a little bit away from my... 90 degree imaginary line isn't it let me change the color and show okay so this is how my imaginary line looks which is right angle but i don't want right angle so what i'm going to do is extend it a bit and that is how it becomes an obtuse angle isn't it next is acute angle a simple and straight one i take it like this and then i will close it from the 90 degree i don't want it to touch anywhere this imaginary line of my 90 degree therefore I am going to just close it after 90 degree and this is how I get my acute angle all right next is right angle we know simple and straight is what I'm going to do is draw a 90 degree and box is what resembles it's a 90 degree or a right angle the other way as well you can draw is this way okay so that is my right angle in any way or any motion or rotation it could be and finally comes my reflex angle as we reiterated my any kind of angle that is my acute type that it looks okay and the arc comes outside important is this arc which should be outside okay so this is what actually denotes my reflex angle which is going to be between 180 degree to 360 degree thank you i hope you like the video keep liking and subscribing and showering your love